Okay, with this tagline, with that, with an organizing team of eight members from the Department of English and Modern Languages, guided by our honorable faculty member, Assistant Professor Kausar, Muhammad Kausaruddin. The purpose of this contest is to motivate and help young creative students nationally to appreciate their potential in the field of photography. As we know, COVID-19 has an effect in every phase of our lives. The process of this contest was also hampered. But we finally are here with the announcement of the winners of our most awaited photography contest. We have Professor Dr. Abdul Rob. Honorable Vice Chancellor of IUBAT as our chief guest, Professor Selina Nargis, Honorable Treasurer of IUBAT as our special guest. We have the presence of the respected panel of 10 judges. We also have our departmental advisor, Professor Dr. Bijoy Lal Boshu, Chair, Professor Dr. Mamtazu Rahman, coordinator ATM Shirajul Alam and all the faculty members of the Department of English and Modern Languages. Tonight, we would like to cordially welcome you all to the grand finale of IUBAT Photography Contest 2021. Throughout the event, I am Tasmiya Haq Ishika. I am Al Roman. I am Shamsia Suba. I am Sanjita Akhtar. I am Isra Tebari. And I am Muktasim Islam Nirjan will be with you. Now, dear audience, we would like to ask for your time to watch the six seasons of IUBAT. An environment designed for learning. The International University of Business Agriculture and Technology, IUBAT, Alimullah Mia, is the founder of the university. I prepared the first working paper for establishing a non-government university in Bangladesh. The university has the primary mission of human resources development. The International University of Business Agriculture and Technology, IUBAT is the first non-government university in Bangladesh. The environment surrounding the campus is healthy, with scenic beauty on the bank of River Tura. Credit transfer from IUBAT is accepted by all universities throughout the globe. IUBAT is very much concerned for quality education and as such, Classes are conducted by qualified and experienced faculty from home and abroad. Not only Bangladeshi students study here, a number of foreign students are also studying in IUBAT. English is the medium of instruction and communication in IUBAT. To implement this, the university has taken various steps, like all classes are conducted in English. The university has 31 departments under seven different colleges. Under the College of Business Administration, there are three programs. Masters of Business Administration, Bachelor of Business Administration, Diploma in Accounting. Under the College of Engineering and Technology, there are five programs. Bachelor of Computer Science and Engineering Bachelor of Science in Civil Engineering Bachelor of Science in Electrical and Electronics Engineering Bachelor of Science in Mechanical Engineering Diploma in Computer Science and Engineering Under the College of Arts and Sciences, the program is Bachelor of Arts in Economics. Under the College of Agricultural Sciences, the program is 
Bachelor of Sciences in Agriculture. Under the College of Tourism and Hospitality Management, the program is Bachelor of Arts in Tourism and Hospitality Management. Under the College of Nursing, the program is Bachelor of Science in Nursing. Permanent campus on 5.5 acres of land, which has been designed by British architect for a university of the 21st century. Well equipped laboratories for all programs. IUBAT follows the North American education system. Enrich library and e-library. Wi-Fi covers the entire campus. It has its own playground and indoor game facilities. All students have health insurance, extracurricular activities. IUBAT has a number of buses and microbuses which provide free transport and shuttle services for students and faculty members. Besides the attractive features, IUBAT provides scholarships to meritorious students and financial aid to all students in need. IUBAT Shikkar Poribes Man Ebong Sagbik Kajokrome Besorkari Bishop Bid Dalegulur Modhe Potom Sari Sofal Bishop Dala is a best plan for any. Upon the completion of undergraduate and postgraduate degrees, students are awarded at the convocation. IUPAT aims to make students self-confident and flexible in order to realize their true potential so that they can play key roles in a rapidly changing social and economic environment. Our goal is to reach out to every village of Bangladesh. There are 87,963 villages. We would like to produce one graduate, at least one graduate, from each village of Bangladesh to create the foundation of a knowledge-based society. So we want education to be accessible to every young man and women who feels that they would like to develop a professional career for their personal development, their family development, their community development, and developing their motherland. Dear audience, thank you for your patience. Now, we'd like to invite ATM Shirajul Alam, Assistant Professor and Coordinator, Department of English and Modern Languages, to say a few words as a welcome address. Uh, thank you very much, Roman. Uh, Chief guest of today's program, uh, Professor uh, Dr. Abdul Rob, Vice Chancellor of uh, IUBAT. Our special guest, uh, Professor Selena Nargis, Treasurer and Director at the Station UBAT. Respected judges, winners and participants, my colleagues and students, and dear audience. As the coordinator of the Department of English and Modern Languages, I feel honored and privileged to be able to welcome you to the grand finale of IUBAT Photography Contest 2021 online. We, uh, let me take you a little bit back to how it started more than six months ago. Uh, when we were online, then the idea came up that we should reach out to people to support the creativity and innov innovation and to encourage the artist self. Uh, so this is how we started. And as we were all struck with this pandemic, so it had to be online. 
uh, it started in 2020, at the end of 2020, and after a long and vigorous process of uh, selection and uh, categorizing the pictures. Now, today we come to the grand finale, to the successful completion of this program. And I personally look forward to its success with all your participation and support in tonight's program. Uh, a few words about uh, uh, the organizing uh, event as well, like Department of English and Modern Languages. It started its journey not long ago, to be more specific in from 2020, the beginning of 2020. And though we had a lot of good things to be proud of, like a prominent uh, scholars in the advisory panel from national and international level, the career uh, focused rich curriculum, diversified team of uh, faculty members. Uh, still, we always felt the urge to uh, be the supporters and promoters of creativity. And this is why if, if you wonder that why we should organize an event like this, so this is what uh, I can say that the photography contest is coming from Department of English and Modern Languages, uh, IOBAT. And we are very much proud and honored to carry the flag of IOBAT throughout the corners of this country because it's a nationwide program and it was a long program for six months. It, it uh, reached out every corner of this country. And I cannot be more proud today to see that we come to a successful end to this long journey. My heartfelt thanks goes to the organizing team, uh, which is led by Mohammad Kasaruddin, Assistant Professor, Department of English and Modern Languages, who is heavily supported by some volunteers who are the students of different batches of BA in English in IUPAT. And of course, not to mention the support and encouragement from uh, the IUBAT authority, from the vice chancellor, from the treasurer ma'am, and everyone uh, uh, from there. So I don't want to <laughs> keep you waiting. It is, again, uh, uh, I am honored to welcome all of you to this program. And I look forward to the successful completion of, of tonight's program with all your participation. Thank you very much for attending. Thank you very much, Coordinator Sir, for sharing your words with us. Now, we would like to invite Professor Dr. Mamtaz Rahman, Chair, Department of English and Modern Languages, to share a few words with us. Uh, Assalamu alaikum. Uh, the chief guest of this grand finale of IUBT Photography Contest 2021, Honorable Vice Chancellor, the special guest, uh, respected treasurer, uh, dean colleagues, uh, our students and their participant of this photography contest. Um, a good evening goes to you. On behalf of the Department of English and Modern Languages, I would extend my heartfelt congratulations and felicity uh, to the participants uh, who have taken part in this amazing contest. Uh, actually, photography is an art. Uh, as one of the judges, I would say that all the shortlisted um, images of eight categories, uh, which are photographed by the participants, seem to be what all the I really appreciate their words. And I would hope that you as the participant um, would be able to participate in numerous events in your future. Uh, the Department of English and Modern Languages uh, has organized and materialized this um, reality competition. Uh, I must thank our colleague, Mr. Kasaruddin, assistant professor who is the lead person and uh, organizer of this competition and has been working so actively since its inception. My thanks also goes to our coordinator and also other colleagues who have contributed to 
materialized such this event. The participants of this program uh, uh, are, are from various schools and colleges across the country. So being the chair of the Department of English Modern Language, I would uh, actually, I have the opportunity to say a few words about this program offered by the Department of IUVAT, a Greenish University, which is really designed for learning in the 31st century. And dear participants, our BN English program is one of the programs of IUVAT. The English curriculum was designed uh, for the students as for the needs of the demands in 21st century. So after completion of BA in this program, our graduates will have access to many uh, job fields in the country, abroad as well. We hope that some of the participants might be prospective students in your future, and we hope so. Uh, I hope that the department uh, of the university you meet you will continue as this wonderful photographic contest. Lastly, I wish all the participants every success in their academic life. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir, for your valuable words. So dear audience, now it's time to hear something from our judges panel. So firstly, I would like to invite Dr. Professor Dr. Utpal Kanti Dash, coordinator of the Department of Computer Science and Engineering, IUBAT, to share his feelings about this contest. Uh, probably uh, for network issue, uh, well, Paul Kanti sir maybe could not join. So at this moment, I would like to request Mr. Zubair Yusuf, National Coordinator, Messenger of Peace, Bangladesh Scouts, to share his experience with us. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. The Honorable Chief Guest, Professor Dr. Abdul Rob, the Vice Chancellor of IUBET, IUBET. The Special Guest, Professor Selina Narbis, the Treasurer, IUBET. And presents are the distinguished guests. Assalamu alaikum. Actually, I feel very honored to be here as a judge in this grand finale of the photo contest in this evening. In the pandemic, in this pandemic situation, this kind of activity take a great help to our youth. I hope and believe this will make them confident. I especially working with the youth through Bangladesh Scouts as national coordinator of Messenger of Peace Initiative. The Messenger of Peace Initiative is a worldwide initiative where all Scouts of the world are connected with a internet platform and share their doing and inspire others. And I believe these kinds of activity will inspire all the youths of the world because I have already shared this initiative to our MOP platform. I believe this photographic contest differently inspire with others. And lastly, again, I thank and grateful to be a part of this uh, photo contest organized by the Department of English and Modern Language Department. Thank you all. Assalamu alaikum. And thank you very much for sharing your experience with us. It really means a lot. At this moment, we would like to invite Dr. Bijalal Boshu. Associate Professor, Dhaka University, and Advisor, Department of English and Modern Languages, IUBAT, to say a few words about this contest and tonight's program. Thank you. Uh, good evening, everyone. Uh, at the very outset, I would like to 
congratulate uh, the Department of English and Modern Languages, specifically um, uh, Kausaruddin and his team for organizing this event. Um, I have been a part of this uh, event uh, because I was invited to be a judge and from my experience, it hasn't been easy uh, to act as a judge because uh, we have we received so many good photographs on a diverse range of issues, uh, on a diverse range of aspects. Uh, we got a glimpse into uh, the mind of young people. Uh, it was really uh, amazing to see young people coming up with uh, such thought-provoking and uh, well-taken photographs. So I would like to congratulate all the uh, participants uh, for the good work that they have done. Um, a few words about uh, such events. I feel that um, we need to engage um, our younger uh, uh, people in activities because uh, around the world, uh, we witness, we recently we witnessed uh, um, as you know, spike in mental health issues, uh, depression, boredom. So um, uh, at a time like this, it's really important to find something meaningful uh, uh, to be busy with, uh, to keep ourselves engaged in creative activities, things that uh, are meaningful uh, to us. Um, young people in particular, uh, they are uh, vulnerable in so many ways. So um, events like this uh, are very important, giving them an opportunity to, um, uh, you know, work on their uh, interests, to develop skills and uh, build their future uh, in the process. It is said that uh, in the 21st century, it is very difficult to predict uh, the uh, workplace uh, requirements. When we develop a curriculum, uh, we think about uh, students' needs, not only current needs, but also their future needs. And experts are saying that uh, it's really difficult these days to predict because um, uh, the world of work is changing every 10 years. So what we are uh, training them in or training them for uh, might become irrelevant, you know, uh, after five years, after 10 years. So um, the suggestion is that we have to um, allow students to acquire skills, let's say transferable skills that they will be able to apply you know, in future. So knowledge might become irrelevant, but uh, the skills that they gain, the transferable skills will always be relevant because they'll be able to uh, apply themselves uh, to a new field, if the field changes to a new domain in many ways. So I feel that uh, debates, photography, competition, uh, theater, mm -hmm. uh, sports, all these activities should be integral to uh, university education, to education as a whole at all levels. So um, I'd like to thank uh, the organizers for inviting me to, uh, for uh, giving me the opportunity to be involved in the whole thing. Uh, it, it has been a pleasure. Um, so um, I'd like to, uh, uh, unless I, I, would, I look forward to many such events in the near future. I, 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 I look forward to the exhibition that is going to happen in a few minutes. And I look forward to many such events uh, in the near future. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, sir, for your kind words. So because of time limitation, we cannot invite all of our judges. Therefore, finally, I would like to invite Professor Dr. Monirul Islam, Dean, the, the College of Engineering and Technology, Chair, Department of Civil Engineering, IUBAT, to say something. Okay, assalamu alaikum. I respected by Sincela, Professor Dr. 
of the rob chief guest to this event and this uh, special guest uh, professor shalina argis treasurer of iubat and my dear colleagues and the judges and the specialists from the department of english and languages i am i am apologized because i am in the outside of this uh, my house and i am participating in a public gathering so it is uh, i have the limited scope to scope in front of you so i would like to give some comments on your uh, photography the participants actually i found that maximum of the your photography was very fantastic and and it was very difficult to decide as a just to categorize a category 1 2 and 3 so on so once upon a time when i was in japan it was my hobby to to uh, work as a photographer and i found that so there are so many photos you have taken i could not understand whether you are the professional or or, or i mean the amateur photographer but i found that that this very very i mean the wonderful for me so i think the many participants you are from this uh, outside of iubt and this uh, you are are from the college is it not i think so i would like to speak some things in bengali and english please you by this time you understand before my me the all of the uh, i mean this uh, is for men they have is spoken in, in english because it is the language of iubt so so the things when you become the photographer tokhon tomader onek gulo dikhe dishti rakhte ekta holo presentation shutter speed camera type camera lens light ei jinish gulo adjust korte hoy so normally jokhon ekjon painter paint kore tokhon kintu she tar subject ta tar mathay thake she shetake rong tulir madhye pokash kore tar কালার কন্টাস্টটা জানা থাকলে এবং তার আইডিয়াটা সে ইমপ্লিমেন্ট করতে পারে কিন্তু you have to be careful jokhon tumra pisher ashba ami ami dekhte pelam je onekei ami jani na tumader training nao ache kina but onekei bes sundor sundor chobi tulecho to amar mone hoy iubt english department ke i we should offer our hearty thanks je they have organized a good and and then the fantastic i mean this competition so in future jodi amader we have the photography society in iubt আমরা যদি এই আমাদের এই এই স্টুডেন্ট গুলোকে লিঙ্ক করতে পারি একটা লিঙ্ক ওদের সাথে রাখা যায় যে তোমরা একটু একটা আমরা যদি শর্ট ট্রেনিং অফার করতে পারি দেন ইট উড বি ওয়ার্ক টু ফর দেন সো তোমরা এখান থেকে শিখতে পারবা বাকি জিনিসগুলো অনেকেই অনেকে অনেক ভালো ছবি তুলেছো কিন্তু দেখা গেছে তো লাইটিংটা অ্যাডজাস্ট করতে পারো নাই তোমার সাবজেক্টটা খুব ভালো ছিল অনেকের আবার শাটার স্পিডের কারণে ছবিটা সেরকম যেরকম আসার কথা ছিল সেটা আসে তো এই জিনিসগুলো আমরা যদি আমি আমি english department ke request korbo then they can organize the training session for them with the photography society ebong eta korle am tumra ekta link rakhte parba ar when you have the opportunity please visit our campus you can find is very very nice and natural campus ekhane photography jonno ekta fantastic campus amader ibi ami, ami tomader ke request korbo jodi tomader opportunity thake tumra eta visit korba jara photography te korte pasondo koro you find it is very very i mean the very useful one for you so thank you so much uh, the english department to organize this such a colorful and and fantastic competition and the participants i am the uh, on my personal behalf on behalf of my college of engineering and technology i offer my hearty thanks to you amader uh, ei department e chatta ache tumader ekta share kori joto opportunity peyechi civil engineering department electrical and electronics engineer department mechanical engineer department and computer science and engineering so if you feel interest you can communicate with us because tumader ei ei intermediate shesh korbo tumra kotha na kotha hoyto pora lagh korte jaba amader campus ta joto tumader sathe amader ekta relation develop hoyse so you can use this opportunity and you can come to our campus to visit us we will help you ebon tumra jodi oi eta bolo je amra ei competition e participate korchilam i think you will get the another extra favor from us যে আমরা চেষ্টা করব তোমাদেরকে বিভিন্ন সর্টে হেল্প করতে আর অন্য অন্য ডিপার্টমেন্টগুলো আছে আর ইংলিশ ডিপার্টমেন্ট ইজ ভেরি এক্সিলেন্ট ডিপার্টমেন্ট দ্য নিউ ডিপার্টম
by this time i have to say they 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 progress tremendously and thank you so much participant thank you so much organizer thank you very much see you in the next time allah bless you thank you very much sir, for your inspiring words their audience at this point were ready to present you the winning photos from each category we have eight categories and you all are asked to submit maximum three images under them we really appreciate the way you responded with your wonderful clicks as our judges have mentioned that we had a really hard time choosing our winners from the each category and even our champion we had a really hard time like we have to go through every images and then to the winner but uh, i know we believe that every story uh, there is a story behind every photo that you have sent us and we are really grateful for that we really appreciate the effort you have put behind the photos and thank you again for sending in us with your beautiful images our first category reminds us of a poem written by o puma devi along the simple line a stream of pebbles on the unruffled forehead of a wall in joyful and large openings where numerous geometrical shapes border an innovative perception movement meets stillness hey there you are architecture so our first category is architecture so the nominees for our architecture category are punches taken by samiha kamal mo on the bridge taken by mahmud mannafi suspension captured by samiha kamal mo and lastly peace and prayer taken by sanjida sultana now it is time to declare the winner of the architecture category and the winner for this category is Podda Bridge. Shabdo jano shoti holo. Dhora dilo aaj hati ishe. Baas to be aaj ural dibo. Podda muke heshe heshe. This photo represents the biggest dream of Bangladesh. The photo portrays. a wonder of architecture with the sun setting in the background creating a beautiful golden blue hue this wonderful photo was taken by mahmud mannafi an undergraduate student from military institute of science and technology misc dhaka Congratulations to Mr. Mannafi for winning this category. The next category we have is landscape. And the nominees are History to Akash Tai Jeno as we get up taken by Shweb Hasan. <coughs> The reflection of nature, captured by Muhammad Ashik Hussain Ghazi. Sunset, captured by Raisu Islam Asad. Shomudre uttal dhew jeno hariye niye jai kono ekti kolpona rajje. taken by nur zamil akundo nidhi and the winner of this category is
the reflection of nature this photo shows one of the most beautiful colors of nature which is yellow while seeing this photograph these two lines come to our minds nature rarer uses yellow then another hue saves she all of that for sunsets this photo was taken by Muhammad Ashik Hosan Ghazi. He's a third semester student of Department of Civil Engineering, IUBAT. Congratulations to Mr. Ghazi for winning this category. Now let's move on to the next one. Our next category we have is lifestyle. But first, let's have a look at the nominees. The nominees for this category are The Struggling Father and Son, taken by Simon Shodhi. Hardly trying to come back. Captured by Mohammad Ratu. Durandukonai Show Shop, taken by Mohammad Arafatul Islam. And finally, the paddy drying field captured by Shorab Das. And the winner for this category is the struggling father and son. This beautiful photo shows the rural lifestyle of a father and son. How a father gives his all to support his family. Precious moment was captured by Simon Shoji, a second year student of business administration at Borishal BM College, Borishal. Congratulations to Mr. Shoji for winning this category. The next category we have is natural world and wildlife. The category in which we received the highest number of submissions. The judges had to spend a huge amount of time to choose a final winner. Let's have a look at the nominees. Cat Behind the Rim, captured by Shudip Tanundi. Couples Fly, taken by Koshi Kormakar. And lastly, The Diet of the Squirrel, captured by Tamid K.H. And the winner for this category is Couples Flight. Danai Danai Chue Chue. Rapti hobe bhor, tui gushoki amar hobi, ami hobo tor. Akras gange bhasiye ural digon chota chui, ei jono me, shei jono me, amar hobi tui. This amazing moment was captured by Koshi Kormakar, 
a fourth year student of civil engineering at Potuakali Science and Technology University. Congratulations to Mr. Paul Mukar for winning this category. So our next category we have is Book Preacher, under which we also received quite a lot of unique submissions. And the nominees for this category are Mamota Mui Ma by Mohammed Abu Shoet Shanto. A Lady of 103 by Abu Bakr Siddiq Iman. A Happy Farmer taken by Mubashidur Shadmin. Kete de Noile Manchit to Tibia Kabo, captured by Shoro Jahan. And Creative Art by Shepherd Hambram Panto. And the winner, the book feature category is. A happy farmer. There is an old saying, once in your life, you need a doctor, a lawyer, and a policeman. But every day, three times a day, you need a farmer in your life. When God needed caretakers for the world, so he made the farmers. Very happy moment was taken by Mubashidur Shadim, a student of government Azizul Haq College, Bogura. Congratulations to Mr. Shadim for winning this category. The next category we have is object, which we had quite a lot of unique submissions. Let's have a look at the nominees. Quarantined Feet by Ume Habiba Mitun. Hanging Lantern taken by Parsa Alon. Citrus Sentences by Isra Jahan Esha. Last but not least, Light of Illusion by Farhana Akhtar Happy. And the winner for this category is The Hanging Lantern. Ondhokar ghare ek kone dariye upolobdhi deal bhange karo adhol ostitte আমার চোখে চলছে হারিকেন ওর সাধ্য কম সৌন্দর্য অনেক but now it is time to see the nominations for this category. And the nominations for this category are Life is beautiful, whether it is on the street or the palace. Taken by Muhammad Nazmul Hassan. Making Tea by Ahmed Emarad Hussain Drubo. Next up is The Golden Smile, taken by Mohammad Rakib Hassan D. And finally, Mother's Love by Shorob Daj Gupto. And the winner 
for this category is Life is very beautiful, whether it is on the street or the palace. Goribero Achid Hon. Ta Janeka Jon? Don Shambuder Chevaro, Goribero Shundormon. Shukore, Arkeduna Pai. Rokrito Shu. Bai Duni. amazing moment was captured by Mohammed Nazmul Hassan, a student of government, Shundarbans Agrosha College, Kulna. Congratulations to Mr. Nazmul for winning this category. Now let's move on to the next one, which is our very last category, and it is travel. And the nominees for this category are Pahare Agdin by Onoy Ahmed Opu. Train Journey by Mahmoud Mannafi. Klantumoy Shumoy, Ebum Din Gulo, Jano Etader Ebhabe Ketejai. Kichu Jogano Rachai. Taken by Tito Molli. And lastly, Serenity by Ahnaf Tahmidul Amin. And the winner for our travel category is Bahari Agde. Ami Ekta Bahari Kinte Jai. She পাহাড়ে পায়ের কাছে থাকবে গহন অরণ্য আমি সেই অরণ্য পার হয়ে যাব তারপর শুধু রুক্ষ কঠিন পাহাড় একেবারে চূড়াই মাথার খুব কাছে আকাশ নিচে বিপুলা পৃথিবী চরাচরে তীব্র নির্জনতা আমার কণ্ঠস্বর সেখানে কেউ শুনতে পাবে না student of Morla Tech Udayan High School and College. Congratulations to Mr. Opu for winning this category. Dear audience, with this, we have concluded announcing the winners of our eight categories. We are now close to the most awaited moment of our contest. It is time that we will finally get to know who our grand champion is. There were more than 700 submissions. We have had to review each and every images and come to our last decision. There were a lot of good photos, but sadly we could not make everyone a winner. But certainly we have chosen the best among all photos. And now it is time to announce the champion of IUBAT Photography Contest 2021. The grand champion of this contest is Game, Game of, of Death. death. Yeah. একক আমার বেঁচে থাকার লড়াই জীবন এক যুদ্ধ যার যোদ্ধা সবাই চলতি পথের বাধা করেছে আমায় গ্রাস তবু এ জীবনের স্বপ্ন দেখা এক রাশ আশাবাদের পরিবর্তন আসবে একদিন না জানি কবে আসবে সে সকাল আওয়ার চ্যাম্পিয়ন ফটো ওয়াজ টেকেন বাই মীর আবির হোসেন আ স্টুডেন্ট অফ Bangladesh Army University of Engineering and Technology, NATO. Congratulations to Mr. Abi Hussain for winning this competition.
congratulations to all the winners of this photography contest you all did an excellent job now we would like to invite you participants to share your feelings with us Dear audience, uh, some of our participants has uh, raised their hands. So we would like to ask Mr. Mahmoud Mannafi, the winner of our architecture category, to share his feelings with us. Mr. Mahmoud is a student of Military Institution of Science and Technology, Dhaka. Okay, so Mr. Mahmoud Manafi has got disconnected due to network issue. Uh, I think there are more participants who are willing to talk. I think we can see another participant who has raised their hands. So uh, I would like to ask Mr. I'd like to ask Mohammad Ashik Hussain Ghazi, the winner of our landscape category, uh, to share his feelings with us. Mr. Ashik is a third semester student of Department of Civil Engineering, IUBAT. Thanks for giving me the opportunity. Assalamu alaikum to everyone. Uh, it's me, Ashi Gaji, student of IBT in civil engineering department. I'm in fourth semester now. I'm from Joydepur, Gajipur. And at first, I would like to thank my honorable teachers and judges for selecting my photo in this contest. I'm very much excited and glad today because this is the first time I'm getting some beautiful moments for my photography. Uh, though I'm not a photographer, even I don't have a DSLR camera, also not yet. I do photography with my mobile. This is my hobby and I love to do this. It gives me much pleasure. One thing I want to share that uh, which for which photo I'm getting this beautiful moment. I visited that place three or four days ago. In my photo, you can notice that there are two trees. But when I went there, I found uh, that one tree has been cut down for road construction. And I feel very bad for this. Um, however, I want to thank IBT for arranging this type of contest because this is rare, we found photographic contest in universities. And it was a good thing because this contest was not only for our IBAT students, but also for all school, college, and universities in our country. Uh, there was an opportunity to all express themselves because there was no entry fee even. So it helps us, all of us, to show our photography skills and our taste in photography. Thus, I want to say for me, it is a wonderful moment. So thank you, IBAT, and thanks to judges. Again, At this point, let's invite our champion, Mir Abir Hussein, to share his feelings about this competition and how he feels about winning the champion, the grand prize. So if Mir Abir Hussein, if you're present with us, Please share your feelings. Assalamu alaikum, everyone. At first, I would like to thank Almighty Allah. Also, thank to Honorable Judge and Organizing Committee for organizing this beautiful event. I'm very glad to deliver my speech on, uh, on such an important and momentous occasion in my life. It is a huge honor for me to receive this award. Really, I'm so honored to be here tonight and grateful to receive this award. I think this award inspired and encouraged me for better work in future. Again, thank you all. Thank you. Thank you so much for sharing your feelings with us. We are so glad that we could give you a recognition which you are proud of. And I would like to thank everyone, like our participants who shared their feelings with us and all the best for your future in this area in photography. So thank you again.
So now we would humbly request our special guest for tonight, Professor Selina Nargis, Honorable Treasurer of IUBAT, to say some words about the IUBAT Photography Competition 2021 and about tonight's program. Um, good evening, uh, dear colleagues and very dear participants. Uh, to tell you honestly, I'm not good in photography, but I'm so happy to see that the winner is, is my second choice. Uh, so I think I know something about photography. Otherwise, how could I do that? Okay. The thing is this, um, everyone, all the photographs, what I have seen is, is really wonderful. Um, I saw the other day in my son's house, uh, the, a photograph of uh, Shabuddin. And I was trying to find out what is there? Why the, his photographs are so expensive, so good? Uh, it was of two women sitting down. No, sorry. It, it's, this, one, this one is not for two women, one woman, and it looks like it's a freedom fighter, a freedom fight, what has been going, uh, what has been done in 71. Uh, the girl was sitting uh, with one of her hand up. And to tell you honestly, I, I found that, you know, maybe, maybe, and some bloods are coming on here and there. So maybe, you know, um, the artist who did it, he knows what he did, but you know, it's, 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 it's from afar, it looks really, really nice. So I was sitting for more time to see what is there, but I'm so, uh, so naive in this area, so I couldn't understand. Okay, anyway, uh, all the photographs, to tell you honestly, to me, it looks very, very beautiful, very beautiful. So um, the winner, definitely he deserves a special thank, but all of you have done a good job. Thank you. Thank you all. Thank you, ma'am, for your valuable words and your precious time. Now, we are very happy to invite our chief guest for tonight, Professor Dr. Abdul Rob, Honorable Vice Chancellor, IUBAT. Dear sir, please share your feelings with us. Uh, you have to unmute me. Yes, sir, you are unmuted. We can hear you. Okay, that's great. Well, I did not know that photography could be really so impressive. You know. I've seen photographs. I have uh, been in photography exhibitions. Uh, I have uh, also seen uh, pictures that uh, is not photography, but then the work of workmanship of the artist. But photography has its own field. I would say it's a segment where you can really project things that are real. It's not artificial. It is what it is. So as I was uh, looking at these photographs, every time I was seeing one, I thought this is the best one. So that was really, uh, I would say for, uh, it's a dilemma for me to decide which one would be the best. If I had an opportunity, I would perhaps reward all of them. However, there are some criteria, of course, based on who is the judges. 
chose the best ones. I would not say best ones, but perhaps the one that meets some of the more strict criteria. I'm very happy to see that our young generation, they are interested in life in different ways. They are interested in nature. The photographs that have been shown reflect that the diversity they would like to cover. Uh, I would have uh, invited perhaps more photographs to show because this is perhaps the few best ones. Even those which were not shown here perhaps would have been quite interesting to look at. But at shortage of time, we cannot really afford to do that. But what I would propose that, can we actually have a photo exhibition of these photographers when the campus is open, uh, that uh, they would be displaying these uh, and would be able to watch uh, all of them. Uh, we're not sure when this can be done because it's quite uncertain when the campus will open. But meanwhile, is it possible that uh, we can have an online exhibition of the photographs that was uh, that, that, that was part of the contest. Please check, please explore. And uh, if it is possible, we can also create a site, you know, where this photo can be displayed. Okay, my congratulations to everyone who participated in the photographic competition. And uh, I would say that uh, even though Others get the win, but this is not the last chance. They can certainly participate in other contests and can perhaps win. But forget about winning. What I would say, it's a pleasure to grasp those photographs for the sake of pleasure itself, well, for the pleasure of one, uh, oneself, yeah, I would say. So, uh, I would like to uh, thank the organizer. It was a very nice idea. In the pandemic situation, when everything is stalled, this was really a very good initiative and a very enthusiastic uh, effort, I would say. So uh, each of uh, the team would deserve thanks. I'm not going to mention any specific name because I know that many people have worked uh, together, and they, each of them have good contributions. So, my valued colleagues, once again, thank you. And uh, what I would say to the participants, that we are really uh, happy to see that you have been suggestingly participated in the contest and have made this possible. I would be expecting many more contests like this, Maybe in future we'll be specifying some more uh, areas so that uh, there is uh, uh, wider coverage. Uh, and then uh, perhaps we'll be able to reach a much wider uh, group all over the country so that uh, there is a scope for participation of the talented people. Thank you very much. Once again, good night. Thank you very much sir, for your uh, wonderful speech and giving us your, for, for giving us your valuable time. So dear audience, at this moment, we are very happy to invite Muhammad Kausauddin, Assistant Professor, Department of English and Modern Languages, who has been instructing us since day one to make this competition successful. Uh, on, <clears throat> Honorable Vice Chancellor, Professor Dr. Abdul Rob, respected treasurer, Professor Selina Nargis, 
distinguished judges, dean advisor, chair coordinators, invited guests, ladies and gentlemen, a very good evening to everybody. First of all, I would like to express my sincere gratitude to our respected photographers. Without you, this whole competition would be meaningless. Thank you very much. You have submitted some amazing moments in your photos. Not only you people are talented photographers, you people are professional, very polite and sincere. It was a wonderful experience with you people. I strongly believe we will maintain this lovely relationship. You are most welcome to our university. Please visit our campus whenever you are free. Then I must thank our distinguished judges. You managed time from your busy schedule. It was a really difficult task to select nine amazing photos out of 700 photos. It was really difficult. And you have done an excellent job. Thank you for your time and outstanding work. A big thanks to my departmental colleagues, advisor, chair, and coordinator. You people are very supportive. Coordinator, sir, you have always been with us. Our advisor, Dr. Bijalal Boshu, sir, whenever we faced any problem, whenever we were confused about anything, we just talked to you, you solved our problem. So thank you very much, sir. I would like to especially mention the name of our colleague, Mohammad Sadiqul Islam, sir, assistant professor, Department of English and Modern Languages. Sir, uh, you were there with us in every single step of this program. You supported us whenever we needed any assistance from the administration. And you give us the courage to take such a huge responsibility. So thank you very much. And if I don't mention the name of our honorable treasurer, Professor, Dr. Uh, Professor Selina Nargis, it will be completely unfair. She's the woman behind everything. And she is an amazing leader. She is very cooperative and very polite. So thank you very much, madam, for all your support. I would like to also mention the name of our honorable vice chancellor, Professor Dr. Abdul Rob, who personally called me and guided me to this competition. Thank you, sir. Thank you for all your guidance and all your support. And we will follow all your instructions. Finally, I should mention the name of our volunteers. A group of students of the Department of English and Modern Languages who really worked hard throughout the contest. Uh, Mr. Al Roman, Muktasin Islam Mirjan, Tasnia Hok Ishika, Ishrat Ebari, Sanjida Akhtar, Shamsia Suba, Nusrat Jahan Mim, Sheikh Asif Hossein, and Sultan Arifin. These nine dedicated volunteers, they have been working hard since December last year. Thank you so much for all your contribution. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, I would like to thank you all for being with us this evening. It's been a great pleasure. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you very much, sir, for your wonderful speech. So, dear audience, we are at the end of our tonight's ceremony. We would like to thank all of you for being with us with so much of patience. This is Muktasim Islam Nirjan. I am Shamsia Suva. I am Santi Kapar. I am Isra Tabani. And I am Dasmiya Hafishika. I would like to say a very good night to all. Thank you for joining today. I hope you stay safe and stay healthy. Thank you so much. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum, everyone. Assalamu alaikum.